If you're looking for a high precision tire and wheel bouncer for your garage or race shop, you need to check out the Eastwood electronic wheel bouncer. And today we're going to show you the features and how to use it. To visit Eastwood.com for more information on this piece of equipment or to see our tire changer, all you have to do is click or tap the button in the top corner of the video at any time. Now, if you're interested in the tire changer, there'll also be a link to a detailed video at the end of this video. This bouncer will show you where to apply clip on or stick on weights. You can balance wheels from 10 inches up to 24 inches in diameter and wheels that are one and a half inches to 20 inches wide, covering most wheels available today. The maximum tire diameter for this machine is 34 inches. It operates on 120 volts with a balance range of 0.25 to 25 ounces or one to 999 grams. The balancer comes precisely calibrated from the factory, but does have the ability to be recalibrated if it becomes necessary. It's capable of both static and dynamic balancing. Both processes are similar, with dynamic being more accurate, so we'll show you dynamic balancing since that is what you will likely be doing. Begin by selecting the spindle hub cone that best fits the center hole of the wheel and mount it with a conical end outward. Mount the wheel to the main drive spindle with the center hole over the conical portion of the spindle hub cone. Attach the quick release hub wing lock and spin inward to tighten the wheel. You can now power on the machine, which will automatically initialize and enter it into dynamic balance mode. You can now enter the diameter, width, and offset data. Use the wheel measurement scale to determine wheel rim offset and enter the measurement into the machine. Now use the wheel width and diameter caliper to determine the width dimension and enter that info. Finally, use the same caliper to determine the diameter dimension and enter that info as well. Now, lower the guard over the wheel and tire to begin the spin cycle, which will last about eight seconds and stop. Once it's stopped, the LED indicator will display inside or outside imbalance values. You can now open the guard and slowly rotate the wheel by hand. When all the inside unbalanced position LED lights illuminate, stop moving the wheel and slip the required weights on the wheel rim at the 12 o'clock position. You will again lower the guard to begin the spin cycle for a second time. When it stops, the machine should display a zero, letting you know the weights are in the correct position and the wheel is properly balanced. It's that easy to balance your tires. If you're looking to save money and mountain balance your own tires, whether it's in your home garage or a race shop, this is a setup that can work for you and give you the results you need on a wide range of wheel and tire sizes. For more information on the Eastwood Electronic Wheel Balancer or the Swing Arm Tire Changer, simply click or tap the button in the top corner of the video or follow the link that appears on screen.